<laughs> Real talk. Real talk <laughs> with Michael and Jordan. Yeah, like, why don't women should just conform? Like, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> One sec. Why are you looking up pictures of girls with cat ears? Never mind. <laughs> Dina spent the whole time talking about how much her boobs were jiggling and how incredible it felt, but I found it hard to pay too much attention to her. My selfishness had turned everyone in the lab female, and it was beginning to look like I wasn't going to be able to fix this. Suddenly I had a change of heart. <laughs> so I ignore Nathan and tell everyone it was my fault, and try to beg for their forgiveness. Or should I carry on lying to them and try to find a cure? I was conflicted, and I didn't know how I was going to make the right choice. So, there's an option missing. She either begs for forgiveness and gives up, or lies and continues trying to fix it. She should beg for forgiveness and fix it. Yeah. There's Why, why are they mutually exclusive? It's your fault, take ownership of it, then fix it. Are you okay, Lynn? Not really. That's what I was going to say anyway. That's funny. I would have figured you'd be happier considering you've been transformed into your dream body. You know why I'm upset? I turned the whole lab female because I was too lazy to check some test tubes. And I don't know how to fix it. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. I mean, the writer doesn't really know where the story is headed, so no. why should we? Well, I hope so. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm off to go fondle my massive breasts all night. You're welcome to join me if you'd like. Weren't we like friends when we were dudes before this? Wouldn't that be kind of weird? You mean, yeah, of course. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe we did the little dick, you know, a little bit of dick sucking. A little bit of role play. Man, Dina, you really enjoyed yourself last night. Hell yeah, my original female body sucked, but now I've upgraded to this superior form. I'm really liking it. If things stay good, I'm never changing back. What? You chance? hear that? Women who don't have triple F cups, yeah. you're inferior. Yeah. You, you're not getting the real female experience if you're not <laughs> masturbating with huge breasts. Yeah, I'm not sure I understand uh, why that helps, really. Yeah. I mean, she threw out a line about them being more sensitive, but... I don't think that's true. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna make some bacon and eggs for breakfast. Just a name. You want some? I can't eat stuff like that now. I have to keep my perfect figure. You know how fattening eggs are? <laughs> I'm just gonna eat some toast. Carbs aren't, like, fattening at all. No. Dina, you're so skinny that I could probably fit one hand around your waist. And eating a big breakfast is an important part of any healthy eating plan. <laughs> eating plan? Yeah, I got an eating plan, alright? Don't come crying to me when you get fat. Fine, I'll just eat the bacon myself. No complaints here. Bacon's freaking awesome. I'm freaking awesome. Go back to your room. You're gonna get fat. Schlick yourself. No, I am not! Hey, Dina. Yeah. We're back at this weird statue again, huh? Yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> Lame. She always looks like she's having stomach problems or something. She, like, bends over and, like, <laughs> wraps her arm around her waist, like, ugh. <laughs> Was he, like, a snake? Yeah. Okay. I think you know why I'm here. Yeah, 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 you want the nose serum. You want us to turn you back to normal? What the hell happened to Derek? What the hell happened to Derek? Derek! <laughs> Derek! <laughs> My name is Dina. Not according to your contract, it isn't. Yeah, Bruce. Whoa! Oh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Dina had you a can't make jokes about him, Jordan. Her. He hit someone with his car, and they're dead now. I heard a whole thing about that. It's like you can you call him him um, when, you when, you're, when you're talking about that incident. He's going to be happened. tried as a woman. Really? Well, know. it doesn't matter. They don't try you as a man or a woman. You're right. <laughs> you're right, it doesn't matter. <laughs> That's what the misogynists are trying to get you to think, that it matters. Nina had a different reaction to the transformation than everyone else. It made her a freak. She's still tra Why do we just keep lying to people? She's still transformed into a super sexy female, but it happened in stages over a few days instead of instantly like the rest of us. Why do we need to... Ugh. Why didn't you mention this earlier? We only realized her body was still changing yesterday after her breast and hair spontaneously tripled in size. So you're saying that any of us could suddenly transform into a big-breasted freak? Oh shit, Nathan, tell him it like it is. Hey, 
Oh, my stomach. Theoretically, yes. It's why progress on developing a cure is taking so long. We still have so much more to investigate. We, if we don't spend more time testing, we might only be able to make a temporary cure. Or there could be all sorts of bizarre side effects. Whew. What a dumb bitch. Why didn't you tell Nathan the truth? I didn't want you to get in trouble. You know? I mean, he's kind of our boss, and we're kind of fucking around not doing our jobs. Plus, I'm pretty sure he's a snake. <laughs> never tell the truth to a snake. Yeah, everybody knows that. <laughs> it's like, you know, ghosts can't swim. Mm -hmm. Never tell the truth to a snake. Dogs can't look up. Watch out for furniture. <laughs> like, what do you mean? It's like, you know, just in general. <laughs> Keep your eye on it. <laughs> you never know. That's why when you get chased by a ghost, you're supposed to jump into a body of water. They're like bees. Or vampires. No, vamp- careful. Don't running. get him confused. <laughs> <laughs> vampires are expert swimmers. They have to be running water. <laughs> and you have to invite them into it. <laughs> hey, Danielle. How's the simulations going? You're my favorite employee. Um, <clears throat> good. Where's Bree? I don't know. She never came back from lunch. There is something fishy going on here. And it's not just all this stanky pussy. You girls need to clean up. Good lord. Gee, Bree, I wonder why you never got that pay raise. <laughs> Isn't that an insult? Why'd she seem so that pleased wasn't by Brie. it? That's not Bree. Oh. That's, uh, Dan. Oh, this is D D D I, I got all their names mixed up. Bree is they the all black have two ones. Did she say where she was going? She, she was going to the mall. I was gonna go with her, but I bought pizza for- I bought, I brought pizzas from home. Pizza, eh? I hope you brought enough for everyone. We are gonna get that. <laughs> Pizza, eh? That gives me an idea. <laughs> Nathan's gone now. We can do whatever we want. There's test tubes all over the place! <laughs> we can eat in the break room if you really want. No! <laughs> okay. That place smells so bad! I keep telling the cleaners to look into it, but they have no idea where the smell is coming from. That's actually, that is that's, scary. That's where Yale died. They've just been <laughs> hallucinating her. No one's cleaned her up. Oh. It's so gross. No, if you were smart, you'd stop asking about the smell, you'd sit the fuck down, and you'd eat your damn corn. That's so they're keeping the fucking homeless people. <laughs> yeah. I doubt it. I just got a call from her. She's taking the day off to hang out with her girlfriend. Who is? Bree. Bree? Bree has a girlfriend. Yeah, she was talking about a girl she met at the clothing store the other day. I don't think she'd actually ask her out, though. Wow, it didn't take her long to find someone. Yeah, Bree's got guts. Bree's got guts. Bree's got guts. Bree's got guts. I think. I know a sweet place that makes these awesome nachos. We can go there and then do some shopping. I thought you didn't want to eat any nachos. I thought you, thought you were fat. I just don't want to eat bacon! <laughs> or like, eggs. That's like a good plan to me. <laughs> I'll eat pizza and not... Ooh, this is new. Going to a bar. Huh, I've never been here before. Pretty cool, huh? This is where I order our morning coffee from. They have the best pancakes. Jesus. That outfit. Yeah, that's, um... She looks like, uh... <laughs> she looks like Chance Largo from, uh... Airship Downs. <laughs> Yeah. Oh wait, we were, this is we care know this character already. Oh, we do. This is our surfer dude. Oh. You still do the voice though. Oh, I do. Okay. Elaine, you work here? Oh, I've been working here for like a about a year now. How's being a how's being a girl going? Let me guess. We get better tips. It's pretty fantastic. I mean, pretty much like. Uh, Every single aspect of my life was approved, you know? I said surfer dude, not lumpy space princess. <laughs> but my parents, they just don't understand! They kicked me out on the street! Yeah, more Ninja turtle -y. You gotta be like the guy from Spongebob, where he's like, He made me experience high time! Oh. Well, I was doing that, and you said it was lumpy space princess! Can we get a large plate of nachos with a side order of chips? Um... Uh, the, the, hey, bro, the nachos usually come with <laughs> chips! I mean, uh, dead. It's like, I mean, I, that's part of the dish. <laughs> sure, no problem. Thanks, Aline. Bodacious. <laughs> By the way, they high-fived if you're wondering what that sound was. 
<laughs> this is a bar. There's not a cafe. Drinks and stuff. <laughs> Use your. N oh! There's your nachos! Dance! Oh, as we call them, Mexican crunchies! <laughs> Dude, they're like fucking cheese corn bodacious. You got little mini corn board that's surfing on the waves of a fantastic queso topping. Dude, it's like you are a little jalapeno, dude. And you're just like trying to stay on the chip and not get all cheesy. But you do. <laughs> <laughs> There's like other tables waiting for her. <laughs> She's just way excited about the nachos. <laughs> Can Whoa. I get some help over here? Uh, excuse me? I'm trying to soliloquize about these rad nachos! <laughs> okay? Quit harshing my nachos, man! <laughs> so, you'd be fine. Oh, I'd be better than fine! <laughs> Spits. <laughs> Dude, this has been like the best week of my life. Dude, the tips are huge, just like my titties, dude! I got an ace on my paper because I blew the professor! <laughs> like, who knew? <laughs> it was so easy! I mean, I would have done it as a dude, but, uh... Why don't girls do this more often? <laughs> my new favorite character. <laughs> like, <laughs> that we both do. <laughs> slutty, transsexual, <A> surfer. <laughs> Well, I guess that's one less person to worry about. <laughs> Cheesy hands. So you don't. So don't be all. Don't be so down all the time, Lynn. You've got lots of things to be happy about. Here, eat these nachos. They're bound to cheer you up. Oh shit! Did she fucking dose the nachos? I leaned forward and ate some nachos. This is some of the. Wow! This is one of the best things I've ever eaten. Dead. Dead, I know, right? They're pretty great, right? What's in these things? I already told you, dude! You don't want to know, bro! Man, the thousand yard stare. <laughs> what is in them? I was glad to hear that Elaine was happy, and that the explosion had actually improved her life. My negligence did something. Eating those nachos cheered me up somewhat. After, settli after settling the bill with Dina, uh, me and her walked to a nearby clothing store to buy ourselves something sexy to wear. We're already here. Want to see a movie instead? Sure. But first thing we got to do is pick the movie. Oh, you got to pick the first thing, so I want to pick the movie. Oh. Eating food counts as my thing. Hell yeah, it does. Fatty. I'm not fat. You're just unnaturally skinny. Well, I'm still picking the movie. There weren't any good movies showing, but Dina chose to see a silly movie about a group of teenagers being trapped in a mall while they were hunted by a recently unfrozen woolly mammoth. What? You know what? Have you ever heard the writing, like, the writing, like, thing, like, for good writers? Like, to be a good writer, this is a rule you should follow. That your story should take place at the most interesting time in the world you've created? Yes. Okay. The game should have been about that. If this game... Well, even if it was still a, vi a visual novel, mm. like a choose-your-own-adventure, if it was about teenagers being chased, trapped in a mall, being chased by a woolly mammoth, better game. Yeah, a recently unfrozen one, too. He doesn't know what he's doing. It's insane. Yeah. It could be called Mall Mammoth. I don't know what I would call it. Okay. Something like that. Yeah. So... Unfrozen. <laughs> so they get that m Disney money. Alright, that's good. That's the best one we're gonna get. Much like this game. Yeah. <laughs> I'd rather watch Lava Lantula than play this game. I'd rather watch Arachnoquake. That sounds awesome. That <laughs> thing. sounds radical. <laughs> Fucking... Dude, I just got back from Arachnoquake! They're my new favorite band! <laughs> yeah, it's a real thing. Sci-Fi Channel original. Earthquake right. in Louisiana released a bunch of spiders, yeah. and they're hive mind spiders, so they all work as a team, and uh, I think they breathe fire. Hmm. Hmm. Are you sure that's not Lava Lantulus? No, that's new. No, uh, Lava Lantula might be a thing, but Arachnoquake, I've seen it, so they breathe Oh, far. okay. Dude, how come no one ever talks about how, like, Eight-Legged Freaks is a great, like, probably the only good spider movie? Um, I, I, it's old. Yeah? That's it. 
They don't make like it's actually not that great of a movie. No, but it's, it's like it's the it's best like, giant spider movie. Yeah, but it's the same. It's like Tremors, but like with spiders and not as good. Yeah, it's basically it. I got to work on research and I do some. Oh shoot! A giant cell phone! Oh my god! Oh! It's a razor phone! Who's Liam? Yeah, and why does he have a? He's got a razor phone. Boxers, and it's got a picture of something going into a box on it. <laughs> Why? Oh man, I never had a razor, but they always looked pretty cool. It's a boxer, Jordan. Well, I never had a boxer either. You know what? If you want a razor, you should call our sponsor. <laughs> Dollar Shave Club. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm but stupid. They'll was... send you a box of razors for free <laughs> every month. Not for free. Oh man, I was like, who, where could you get a, a razor in this day and age? <laughs> like that. <laughs> Alright, Skeeter. Hello, this is Abaddon Lambs. Liam speaking. <laughs> what? what? Okay. <laughs> Let's try to figure this one out. So, Br it's Brie calling. Yeah. She's take, took, has taken the form of a giant cell phone. Yes. Why is her, her image. Tools. Yeah, her contact in the phone is a two by four, a hammer, and a and like a saw. handsaw. Hmm. And we know that's her contact photo because it says like Bree. It says, her name. it says Bree style in a stylized manner in the corner. Thanks for watching, everyone. <laughs> it's been a good episode, but I think it's time that we wrap up. Yeah, I'm pretty. We'll have to sleep on that one. Yeah, I'm gonna go and uh, saw some hammers. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you have a lynda.com account? You're a you're a you're an expert? I am. I'll help you with anything you need. Speaking of lynda.com, today's episode of Michael and Jordan is brought to you by Squarespace. <laughs> <laughs> Base or bass got an update. <laughs> oh jeez. What happened? What's should the difference? I, should I read you the, the patch notes? You should. Alright. While Michael's doing that, I'm gonna enjoy this delicious toasted almond garlic snack. Oh, where'd Nature you get Bo that? From NatureBox. NatureBox? That's right, Michael. You know what? Ever since I started, like, eating NatureBox, I've lost some weight, I'm getting in better shape, so I had to buy new clothes, so I went to MeUndies.com. Oh my god, me- I, I, I was- Did you, Have you gone to MeUndies? Well, I mean, look at me, look at this swagger. You're- you've got the- you've got the casual terry cloth shorts from <laughs> MeUndies. Oh. And I mean, this shave. It's pretty clean. Where, where'd you shave? Where'd you get those razors, Jordan? Well, actually, I get about a, a one every week. You know, people use razors for you way go, too long. You go to the store once a week for razors? Aha! I knew you would ask that. You fucking retard. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Dollar Shave Club, bitch! <laughs> so mean. <laughs> so, Baser Bass... Updated timing system with a gradual decrease in time between pictures, which I feel like makes it a little... That's going to make it easier mm. to really rack up that score. Better UI. Ooh. <laughs> I can't wait. Um, and when you, inevitably, when you inevitably fail, being told you were either too slow or you slapped the wrong bass Ooh. or bass. So you actually get to know which one it was, whether or not you got something wrong. Yeah. Because if it was a trickier one, you might just... Might have ran out of time. Yeah, you might not know. You might be like, I swear that was yeah. a bass. It's like, sure, you know, I could go, I could go hit him on top, you know, but we all know I'm going hit him on Lee. Michael likes Asian people. No, I just like Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I got from that. Michael likes <laughs> Asian people. Hit him on Lee. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> I, I wasn't just saying that. Oh, <laughs> It was the Pokemon I picked that was the problem, not not the fact that I picked a Pokemon at all. <laughs> um.